All right, we want to verify the identity for this trig function. So get the left to look like the right. So what we're gonna do is break it down to its simplest components. So sine theta for the tangent sine theta over cosine theta plus cosine theta over sine theta for the cotangent. So the common denominator is gonna be cosine theta or cosine theta sine theta. I'll just make it sine theta cosine theta. So what I end up getting is uh, for the left side, you get sine squared theta at the top because you're multiplying times sine over sine. So this becomes sine theta cosine theta. We need to do this in order to add it. So we get cosine squared theta over cosine theta, oops, over sine theta cosine theta. So what this becomes on top, this becomes um, sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta. Careful on the bottom, you don't, it's not two, it's, it's just a common denominator, so you just put them together. So this is a trig identity, it's equal to one, and that's how we get it equal to one over sine theta cosine theta. That's it. All right, I hope, the, I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching, have a great day.